Hello. Have you ever wanted to make your tank turrets move sideways, but you're on mobile? Well, I think I have the solution to that. If you watch this simple tutorial, you will, in the end of this video, you will be able to have a tank turret that moves sideways. You're gonna wanna start off by moving your whole tank turret upwards by 10. Let me just select all of these. And then... Okay, just need the radio now. There. Okay. Next, we want to turn off collision on the it, these areas so that it doesn't, well, it doesn't break the mechanic. Like that, I think. It's just that, yeah. Turn on collision here, yeah. It depends on your tank, actually. And then move it down by 10. Connect it to a switch. And move it forward by 2. Next, make the piston length 10. We want space enough to place like two wheels. Do that. Select these, bring it down a little bit. Actually, yeah, that seems good. Turn on reverse rotation on this, clone it, delete the last wheels, and then put those wheels back into place. We should put buttons. Yeah, we, we we're gonna put buttons on the top and make sure you know where you put these buttons so that you can use it while on the tank. I'm gonna go ahead and connect these to the wheels. Make the wheel speed to 1, 1, and then wheel torque to green. Afterwards, click the piston 2, just select the piston, and then turn off collision. Okay, this is starting to look really good. Now turn off collision. Make it completely invisible. And I think that's done. Yeah. That's about it. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. I forgot to connect the piston to the tank body. Okay, so don't make the same mistake as me. Let me just reload it real quick. Now, we just finished loaded. Uh, loading. And we want to place a block of titanium right here. Yeah. Just like so. And scale it upwards so that it touches the tank body. Now, turn the transparency to 100% and turn off collision. Save your build. And load it. After doing so, 
you want to unanchor the whole build. I mean, select your whole build and then unanchor that. Turn on the switch that was connected to your piston and ride around in your tank. By the way, you have to remember where the button was. Like so. Thanks for watching guys and see you in the next video. Bye. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe.